how to add this really clean, transparent watermark that you've seen in TikToks and edits to your videos using CapCut. It's actually super easy. So first open CapCut and on our brand new timeline, we're gonna click the plus icon. Now, whatever you add here really doesn't matter. So I'm just gonna add a random video clip from the CapCut library. Again, it really doesn't matter. I'm gonna click on that layer and then slide it off screen. And then on our bottom, we're gonna scroll all the way over until we find background, click that and then click color. Scroll over to green and boom, there you go. Now scroll back over and find text and then click add text. And this is whatever you want your watermark to be. In this case, I'm gonna do BC strike because that's just my name, I think it looks dope. And then we're gonna go over to fonts and you can choose whichever font that you like. I personally really like this atomic marker font. I think it looks really sweet, especially when it comes to a nice watermark. Then click styles scroll over to shadow and add a black shadow make sure it's at opacity 100 and turn the blur off press the check mark make sure it's nice and big now just screenshot that watermark so you have this photo right here save that to your files and then go to wherever your edit or your video that you want to add your watermark to is click overlay add overlay then you're gonna go photos and then add in your screenshot right there once it's over, scroll over on your timeline till you find transform and resize. And we just wanna make sure that this is cropped so we only see the green part of the logo. Boom, just like that, press done. And now we can scale this up and then just press the three arrows backwards, scroll to the left until you find remove background and then chroma key. And we're just gonna select that green color, get rid of it, turn the intensity up just a little bit, clean up the edge, that's the one that I messed with just a little bit. Boom, just like that, you can probably do 10 and 10. It works great, as you can see, there's very little to no green left, looks awesome. Press those three dots again, scroll all the way over to the left until you find splice, click that, and then click the third option that says overlay. And this is gonna give it a really cool transparent look on your video. Readjust the text however you'd like, and then you're good to go to export it, and this is the final result. Now you guys know,